Hey guys, how are you doing? So Apple released iOS 18.2 update to all the comparable iPhone and iPad models yesterday and some users are experiencing problems with the new services Apple have released. For iPhone 15 Pro and above models, Apple have released the new set of Apple intelligence features and for all other iPhones, Apple have made some minor feature enhancements and mostly bug fixes and security fixes. When it comes to the Apple intelligence features, uh, you know, the Siri voice response is not working properly for for some users like when they submit a request when they summon Siri and ask any question instead of providing the voice response it was just mute and you have to read all the conversation text for example use chat GPT to tell me about what is Apple intelligence here's an answer from chat GPT can you read this aloud I can't read aloud but you can use a text-to-speech tool or software on your device to hear it read aloud Show me the previous finding, answer. Me know. Here's an answer from ChatGPT. Stop using ChatGPT and read me this text. Sorry, ChatGPT hasn't added support for that with Siri. Just tell me about Apple Intelligence. Apple Intelligence combines the power of generative models with your personal context to deliver personal intelligence. It is designed to understand and create language. So you can see the voice response is working, but as it is still in beta, the way it responds is kind of a little bit, you know, buggy. It'll be improved, I hope, in upcoming iOS 18.3 and 18.4 major releases. And when you navigate inside the Apple Intelligence and Siri section, you know, the settings, you can see the Siri responses and make sure it is set to prefer spoken responses. So if you have enabled this, Siri voice response will work better. If it is set to automatic, then most of the time I have noticed that the voice response is not working. And some users may have this one default setting to prefer silent responses. So in such cases, you will not be able to hear what Siri tries to tell you. So make sure that it is set to prefer spoken responses and then the voice feedback from the Siri will work. If you're still experiencing any issue, then you need to check for the voice section and make sure the files also downloaded or it may be showing some percentage it will be on hold and waiting for the Wi-Fi connection in order to download the files so try connecting your iPhone or iPad to Wi-Fi and then selecting the voice here will help you to fix Siri voice response not working on your iPhone and iPad give it a try and see if it helps or not and for more useful iphone ipad and mac related tips and tricks don't forget to subscribe thank you so much for watching have a wonderful day